seconds count when first responders race to an emergency and nothing should get in their way. But recently there have been in incidents of people not pulling over to the side of the road for those emergency vehicles. One paramedic is so fed up he filmed a car doing this for miles. New Center Maine's Roslyn Flaherty has more. Despite the blaring sirens, this red car in Auburn isn't pulling over for an ambulance. I've never seen this before quite to this extent. Paramedic Michael Blakemore captured the incident on his cell phone last week while responding to a call for a woman with shortness of breath. He says the car never pulled over. We just kept chasing him all the way until we hit our road and turned right. Blakemore says people not pulling over has become a serious problem. Almost every call. Maine law requires drivers to immediately pull over when an emergency vehicle has its sirens and lights on. Failure to do so can result in a $250 fine. If you are in bed and suddenly your loved one stops breathing and you call 911, you don't want people getting in the way of that ambulance. You want them, that ambulance, to be at your house now. Blake Moore says it's not only dangerous for the public, but for the people in the back of the ambulance as well. They don't realize that we might have a patient in the back and there might be providers literally standing up. There is nothing in the back of that ambulance that anybody wants to hit going 50 miles an hour. That's pretty much dead. The video has more than 19,000 views on Facebook. Blakemore hopes by posting it, people will pay more attention to the road and turn down their music. So emergency crews can get to their destination quickly and safely, especially when every second counts. Roslyn Flaherty, New Center, Maine. Wow. Again, not only can not pulling over be a matter of life or death, it's illegal too. Blake Moore says he wrote down the license plate number of that car and called police. You can watch the full video on our website or mobile app.